Hey guys, in this video, I'll be showing you guys how to get battery percentage on your iPod Touch running the latest iOS 7 without jailbreaking. So, as you guys can see, I'm going to go into settings and uh, general and okay, and go to about. And there it is, 7.1.1 right there. So, I am on the latest uh, update for iOS 7, and I do not have Cydia installed, and there is no option for a battery percentage in here. So, um, as you guys know, I just showed you there's no default battery percentage for the iPod Touch. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you how, do you, guys, how you guys get it. Just connect your device into iTunes, and uh, let's go from there. Alright, inside of iTunes, um, as you guys can see, my version is 7.1.1 right there. And uh, go ahead and hit backup now with um, the backup to my computer part selected. Be sure to get that selected. Alright, here you will go ahead and exit iTunes and download iBackupBot. I'll have a link to download that in the description. And uh, open it up and you'll just see something like this. And be sure it's the latest version. Go to your device and you go to click on System Files. And go to the search bar right here. And type in com.apple.sp. And type that in and hit Enter. And you should get three files or two. And you select the... Um, the com.apple.springboard.plist. There'll be two, but one of them will be bigger than the other. Let me go ahead and show you right here. This one's five, and the other one's 507 kilobytes. So let's go ahead in here on the first line called DICT. Go ahead and uh, click on that as well. I'm going to focus. Click on it and uh, enter a new line. Hit enter. And here you'll paste in this code using the paste button. That's copy right there. And that's paste. Click that in. I'll have that in the description for you guys to copy. And now just make sure everything is lined up. Now go ahead and hit the save icon up right there and hit close. Alright, do not hit restore right now because it will not work. It will give you an error like I have shown in a previous video. Um, that method at least. So go ahead and go to your iPod and uh, go ahead and go to settings. Uh, the iCloud section right here. I'm go ahead and do this, and turn off Find My iPod Touch. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and enter my password for this, and I'll be right back. All right, once you have turned off Find My iPod Touch, go ahead and head back to your computer, and now you hit Restore. Um, be sure you select that file before you hit Restore. Select the file and Restore. Leave the option set to full. Hit OK. And you should get this little bar just like that. And your device should have this uh, jump to this restoring screen, on kind of like the lock screen. And all right, it's shutting down. So that's how you know your device has having some changes being made to it. So go ahead and just wait, and your computer is done. We're done on the computer. All right, guys, uh, your device should be booting up just like that. And there we go. Let's go ahead and slide to unlock here. And there we have it. In the corner we have battery percentage. Let me go ahead and focus and there's battery percentage where it usually is. And it does say 77% uh, seven, right there. So let me go ahead and show you there's still no toggle here inside of settings. Right here. See no toggle and we are on. Let's confirm we are on 7.1.1. And indeed. Alright, I hope you guys like this video, and um, please enjoy your battery percentage, and go ahead and rate me up, give me a thumbs up, and leave a comment down below if you guys have any questions, and if you want to revert the process, you can just reverse the process I showed you, just find the code, it'll be in a different place. Alright, thanks for the support guys, um, thanks for the views on another video, and peace.